here for North Dakota, and they put a turnover there for the Hawks. Point of emphasis for North Dakota State. Get their bigs to run the floor. They think they can wear Avance down. Open look for Paul Miller, and the senior from Wisconsin cashes in. The first eight points in this one going to the visitors. And what you expect, they had both teams getting after it. Crandall gliding his way to the basket. Up and over Dengu for the bucket. Distance. The lead goes back to 11. Again, credit Quayle, great penetration, didn't hurry. Keenan Walter with the answer at the other ends. <laughs> the bigs getting it on the act for both of these teams from behind the arc. That's the show. That hits. North Dakota struggling from the floor. 3 of 12 now tonight. Bison in transition. Tyson Ward down low. Eliason! And a timeout here for Brian Jones. And Coach Richmond's frustrated. He's saying he's keeping his left foot planted, and he's just taking a second step with the right foot. It looks awkward. Dale Jones, nothing awkward about that. Beautiful fadeaway hook. Green. This crowd is getting up. Miller strips. Crandall in transition, one on two. Billy Brown on the putback. What a great effort by Brown to follow it up. And Stewart over to Crandall now as Jones will reset a chance for North Dakota to pull within one or tie this thing up. Crandall, acrobatic <laughs> behind the head and in. He faked the pass to Jones, flips it. Miller too strong, Stewart the other way. Nice dish demo to Avance. Connor the spin off the glass and in. First bucket of the night for number 32. Now that's the thing about Avan. Finds the open shooter, kicks it to him. AJ Jacobson, five points now. First triple attempted. Avance basket in the foul. Well, great job by Stewart coming off the ball screen action. Gets it right back down to Avan. Eliason tries to recover. He's inside the block charge off block charge arc. So no matter what, if there's a foul call, it's going against goal. Now Crandall the other way. Avance the skip pass stolen by Tyson Ward. Ward too strong off the back iron. Jacobson on the offensive rebounds, and now the senior called for the travel. That's Jones third right now in the Big Sky and rebounds this season. Able to bring down his fifth tonight. Bison still winning the edge on the glass, 21-14. Brown. For three, yes! They're saying he didn't leave the ground. Felt like there was a whistle there for a moment as if it was. Crowd is back into it now. Four-point ball game. Crandall for three. Gino Crandall knocks it down. And the Bison lead is back to one. Now this is exactly what you expect. Base top, baseline, back screen action. Tyson Moore, nice dish down low. Eliason from point blank range. Well, just a big time play by Tyson Ward. Didn't for the fadeaway from Paul Miller. 21 now for the senior from Wisconsin. Marlon Stewart right back the other way. Basket of the foul. Well, that's I just give Stewart so much credit for initiating the contact, initiating the action, putting the pressure on the official to make the call. I think Samuelson's in pretty good. Pretty good position. Actually, I think it should be a no call, but credit Stewart. His but for two more, and then they're home again because they start conference play in the big sky. The Summit League, obviously, with IUPUI leaving, has changed everything. And so North Dakota State still has at least six more non-conference games to play. So really unique how these... Jacobson with nine to shoot. The handoff. Miller at the rim. Just great movement without the ball. Miller's defender takes a move. Triple team here is Miller, ball stolen. Crandall the easy lay in at the rim. And just like that, the lead down to six. More pressure here. But North Dakota State's a nine point advantage here. They can run the clock out and snap that three game losing streak. NDSU, their fourth win of the season. None as sweet as this. 88 to 79, your final.